Welcome to Ascot for the final trials day. We've got four flat races, two hurdles and two chases today on a mixed card. The first race is a two-mile hurdle. And the top one is rear window for Alex Cherry. Forest Gate for Conrad Leggett. Morley Street, David Hooley. Fifth odd point, Darren Thompson. has also got Sibford Ferris. Patch Shamali for David Robertson. Cowboy Boots, Era and 2468, Derek Hinton. Sierra Messiah for Craig Allen. Dominion of Darkness, Joshua Southern. Tons of Sobs, Martin Leadham. Duke of Finsbury, Paul Rhodes. Alien Assassin and Baltic Dragoon for Graham Clitterbuck. Twisted Island for Alex Cherry, Let's Dance for David Hooley, Venaria Prend, David Robertson, Shaw Shanghai, Craig Allen, Rough Weather, and Ward Spirit for Leon Van Rensburg, Midnight Hour for Martin Lidham, Carlita Negra for Paul Rhodes, Night Star for Ryan Costello, and Bakersfield Remix, and Fresno Witch for Vinnie Gerard at the bottom. So 25 in, place the starter, and away we go on this first race of a mixed card, eight races. The final trials day before the new season gets underway next month. And Bakersfield Remix is the one that's gone straight off into the lead. Chased by Brace of Grey, Sierra Messiah and Duke of Finsbury as they get over the first of the eight flights with Bakersfield Remix past the big crowd here yeah, for today's event. With Bakersfield Remix clear by a good four lengths. The rest of them are just about headed by rough weather for Leon van Rensburg in the dark blue of the yellow cap looking towards the back of the field. 2468 is just a back marker as they pass the winning post and with a complete circuit of the Ascot track to go. And some good big fields in these races today. That's mainly because it's an opportunity for the new handicappers to have a little bit of a practice. They're going to handicap these races and then we're going to run them again later in the week or next weekend and see how the results work out. So that should be pretty interesting. And well done to Alex Cherry and Conrad Leggett for volunteering to be the new handicappers for the new season, which means we can get underway soon. I'm still looking for another commentator if anybody's interested so let's get over the second flight of hurdles and Bakersfield Remix continues to lead from Baltic Dragon who's now moved through into second then comes Rough Weather and Dominion of Darkness with Twisted Iron and Wood Spirit after that one. Night Star is also close up as they get over the third flight. All safely over that one with Cowboy Boots error, the last one in shot. 2468 is a little bit detached from the remainder and he's out of shot altogether. But Bakersfield Remix has been in the lead all the way so far for Vinnie Gerard. Leads by a good three or four lengths as he gets over flight number four. Rough Weather in the blue jacket is second. Then over on the far side, Dominion of Darkness is next. Joshua Sutherland back in the trial for the first time for a while. Then after that one comes Rough Weather and Night Star, Alien Assassin and Baltic Dragoon. Then Wood Spirit, Fresno Witches on the inside as well. The ones, ones who are caught really wide on the track there. The Darren and Robertson, uh, the um, Darren Thompson horses, and it's Bakersfield Remix who's still in the lead by about three or four lengths. Then to Alien Assassin, who's the first of the Greys in second, then Night Starting of the Greys third, the Mean of Darkness on the inside is fourth as they get over number five. And up on the outside there, Patch Shamali has now come through to move into second, but it's Bakersfield Remix who continues to lead from Patch Shamali, Dominion of Darkness, Duke of Finsbury, another Greys now getting into it as well, also trying to make some move on the outside is Sierra Masara as they get over the sixth, that was the third from home, and it's Bakersfield Remix who's still got the lead being pushed along on the inside, Patch Shamali looks to be going well, Dominion of Darkness is trying to chase in third, Twisted Island has now come through, also coming through on the inside there is Shaw Shanghai, the race now beginning to Unfold and Bakersfield Remix leads only by a length to Pat Shamali in second. Shaw Shanghai looks to be going well, but couldn't be running into a dead end as they sweep into the straight. They've got three furlongs to go and they've got two more flights to take. And it's Bakersfield Remix who's opened up by two again. Good jump by Shaw Shanghai has now got a clear run in second. Then comes Pat Shamali. Fresno, which is trying to run on the alien assassin twisted on. Let's dance is coming from the back. But now Bakersfield Remix is being challenged for the first time by Shaw Shanghai. They get in the final flight. Over they go. Shaw Shanghai one of two it just but here comes Fresno. Witch, Bakersfield Remix, Fresno Witch, and it's looking like a really giant one two at the moment of Fresno Witch, the great closest to us, but now being pressed again by Shaw Shanghai, Shaw Shanghai, and here comes Pat Jamali. Pat Jamali has burst through Dominion of Darkness, he's trying to get in there as well, but it's going to be a close one as they come towards the line. And Pat Jamali takes it, Dominion of Darkness is second, Shaw Shanghai is third, then Fresno Witch, and Bakersfield Remix, and Wolf Brother, and Fresno, and Morley Street, who didn't get into it today. And all the way back to the Derek Hinton pair at the back of the pack. It all changed after that final flight. Like Vinnie Gerard was going to get a 1 2, and he ended up with a 4 5. But Pat Shamali just taking it from Dominion of Darkness, Shaw Shanghai, and Fresno Witch. As we get a full look at the finishing order, you can see where you finish. Pat Shamali for David Robertson, the winner. Dominion of Darkness for Joshua Sutherland, second. Shaw Shanghai for Greg Allen, third. And Vinnie Gerard, fourth and fifth, with Fresno Witch and the long time leader. 
Bakersfield remix, so that's the first one for the new handicapper on the jumps. Alex Cherry to get stuck into and see how that race turns out again when we run it again next time.